Welcome to the Solo Masterclass, a series of full unedited raids recorded live where I go through each quest solo, just myself and Tarkov. Enjoy the chaos. Not a bad little spawn. Maybe. We can get it to run. Okay. Uh, gonna go in here into the chalet, loot up around there, hit the save, check the um, valuable spawns, kill some scabs if there are any, avoid PMCs. Um, if we get some, that's fine too, because we do need to get 10 PMC kills. We're only getting 50 FPS. Keep an eye on that door over there behind the generator. Because depending on where other people spawn, if they run straight here, that will open about the same time you get in here. Okay, nothing. Permit it. Alright, still closed. Gonna run into the garage. Check the valuables. Nothing. Back here. Nothing. Okay. Oh, paracord. Nice. 12k. Master files aren't bad. Anything else? Doesn't seem like it. Check the toolbox and we'll head inside. That's nice money. It's real nice money. FPS, Jesus. Military cable, nice. Okay. Not seeing anything. Not seeing anything else. What's that? Nothing good. Okay. Don't see anything else. About six or something there for a second. Okay, I already checked that. Magnum, I'll take that. What else you got for us? More meds and not bad. Uh, let's see, unload. All right, anything of value in here? Key. No. expecting him to shoot at me. Anything. Born on Suga. Scab. I gotta go down here to grab the uh, dead bodies for therapists anyways.
check in here quick. I need a bigger backpack or vest or something. Shit. Take that. Can I throw that on here? No. Fantastic. Alright. Grab these bodies. Okay. Now we can get out of here. We got a full bag and got a couple of scav kills. So we have no reason to stick around. Pretty sure I just heard another scav, I thought though. might have heard a scab, but I guess not. Yeah, we do have Southern Road. Just wanted to verify. I'm pretty sure you always have that one. If you are running by here, watch out for that chair there. Uh, you can get valuable spawns on it. So it's worth checking if you like don't have, if you're just at the very beginning of a raid and going by it or anything like that. Um, right now I'm not going to just because I got a full bag of stuff already. So possibly one more item, um, but also possibly being very exposed and possibly dying there. It's not really worth the risk at this point because it is a rare spawn. So they don't always spawn there. So the odds of something being there are kind of low. But if there is something there, it's probably going to be decent. So, if you got mu don't have much to lose, I'd say check it. But if you got a lot to lose, I'd say don't. So like right now, I, I'm going to get out. I'm going to have a couple hundred thousand with the rubles at least, so I don't have much reason to really go risk everything for a chance at getting something. see anybody so I should be good here so don't see anyone okay basically in the clear now all right now I'm good cool nice quick little raid got a couple of scav kills not too bad and got a decent amount of loot, so I got what, one, two scav kills, I think it was. And a decent amount of loot, so made some money. Got a little bit of progress on the quest, so all in all, it's successful. Okay. Where's spawn? Not the best spawn for us, honestly. I can get back up here to the chalet area pretty quickly. That might be the move. Because a lot of PMCs are going to go straight to looting it. So if I can get back up here and kind of sit it from the top and pick them off, it might work out really well for me. Get it ran out of stamina. You want to jump through those, get through as much of them as fast as you can. Ooh, that could have been bad. hearing anybody you just hear that one shot oh, that one shot 
I would assume is at the upper chalet. Could be wrong though. It also sounded like a shotgun. God damn it. Didn't mean to hit that bush. That tree scared the crap out of me. The door shut. What in the fuck? Okay. That's weird. Either nobody's here, or they're here, found something really good, and left straight away. still isn't open, so there is a good chance that just nobody came here. That's a player outside, I think. Cute. That's a scab. Probably should crouch there. Oh well. Hello, how's it going, man? How you doing tonight? Okay. Run back downstairs and go grab that scav kill. Oops. Thank you. Well, that's one. That was also some shitty aiming on my part. Let's check that. Uh, check the garage. On here. Can't see him. right there. Just open the door. It's 
two of them. Got one of them. Fucking run. Oh, my leg's black. I can't run. I think the others are just a scav. I think there's another one down that hallway. Hello? Okay. I'd like to open the door, please. Shit. Heal the leg up. Get some more ammo. Gonna take that guy's gun more than likely. Uh, he wasn't expecting us to be outside, so caught him off guard pretty bad, I'm pretty sure. you got for me nice thank you and I'll take that as well I'll even take that I'm very tempted to take that armor what ammo you got I think that's a maid but I'm not super sure let's fit shit So, we're taking it. About half of M80. Okay, now we're going to get out of here. Yes, I'm greedy. All right, let's get out of here. No, they're solo. I've been running into a ton of squads lately. What the hell are the cats doing out there? But anyways, I will say it feels so much smoother with the red dot instead of a scope, because like, that just feels way better than like that. It just feels so choppy. So I think that could be a lot of my issues. So here, I'm gonna check something. All right, 40, 38, 40, 41, okay. And then 40, 38, 33, 35, 36, 35. So yeah, I am getting less FPS with it. Um, so that would explain a lot of why it feels smoother without the scope. And considering I'm like not even hitting 60 FPS on Lighthouse right now, that's gonna make a huge difference. Even like five or six FPS will make a huge difference um, for just how it feels. So the more I can get, the better. So yeah, I just need to avoid using scopes like at all completely. So I think that's part of why I've been struggling so much because um, I've been using that Smith and Bender uh, one to eight X, which is a good scope. It's just 
I don't have the frames to support it, quite frankly. Right, nobody over there? Cool. All right. Nice little raid. Got a PMC kill and a scav kill. So, making progress. Couldn't believe I got that PMC kill with a freaking shotgun, too. Just, mm, I hate the damn shotgun, so. That's nice to see. But yeah, I think I'm just going to start selling basically all my scopes. Um, unless I'm like trying to use it for a sniper or something like that. I wonder if I put a scope on and then had a canted iron sight. Oh, I got two scavs. What was this first one? Oh, yeah, on the stairs outside. Okay. Um, I wonder if I put on a canted iron sight. Or not iron sight. It's canted sight with a scope if when I would aim down the canted if my FPS would still be fine and then when I aim down the scope they'd suffer a little bit because if I did that then I could use a scope for distance in this uh uh for like sniping for like the rogues or anything like that and I could just use the red dot for everything else essentially this too yeah I do I forgot to do that drug trafficking so that's in the back of lighthouse cool and then, yeah, Punisher Part 4. Got one and four, so I need six more scavs. Oh, um, not... Ooh. This is not a bad spawn, because I can grab the briefcase. I'm pretty sure it's the second one, but I'm not 100% sure. Uh, no, it's the first one. Okay. Anything worthwhile over here, though? It doesn't look like it. I don't actually know what all spawns in these buildings never really go over here except for this quest so not super sure i just want to look one more time nothing nothing at all no okay okay maybe all right kind of need to watch up at the top of the hill there people will go up there and will shoot at you Yeah, I remember it's this first one because you can like look way down the beach. Yep, there it is. Perfect. Okay. Don't see much of anything. Where should we go from here? I think maybe we just go across the road. See if there's any scavs down there. While we make our way. See if there's any scavs here on the road. Um, if there's not, if there is, then we can take them out because that'll go through the quest. Don't ever use a red dot if you don't have a suppressor. Why not? So I do it fairly frequently. Oh, are you talking about because of like the smoke trails and whatnot? Because kind of, you can kind of get them lost in that. I don't have much of an issue with it. I mean, it is a little bit, depending on the gun and depending on how much you're firing. But I'm using quite a bit. Basically, no matter what early, early wipe, I basically always use just a red dot without a suppressor because I just don't feel a need to, ru to run them because you're going after scav kills anyways. So half the time when the scavs shoot, you're making noise regardless of whether you want to or not even if you have a suppressor, so it's no point spending the extra money on it when at the beginning of the wipe and at your lower levels, you need money real bad. Thought I might have heard something to my right. Anything in here worthwhile? Doesn't look like it.
I don't see anybody. There's that safe over there, but I don't have the key for it, so it's not super important for me to go and check. anything yet. Quiet raid so far. You know, now that I think about it, the last two raids there haven't been a ton of gunshots or anything been fairly quiet. That's a scab. How did you not die? What? Hello? Jesus. <laughs> Granted, I know it's hip fire, but the aim's not that bad. Jesus Christ. That was, that was bad. That was on my, that was on me. God damn it. That was a PMC. That was just fucking awful. Holy shit. I couldn't aim worth shit there. Holy crap. Wow. Mm-hmm. Nice username. And the iron sights are means to press or blocks the iron sights on the shotgun. Yeah. Yeah, no, I feel you. Um, I just, I hate running shotguns so much because of literally that. Take like forever to reload. And they just, I don't know. I never have good luck with shotguns. I feel like I can't aim with them literally at all. Where did I just spawn? Oh, I'm, I think I know where I'm at. Yep, I know where I'm at. Okay, right, so this time we're gonna do something different. Shit. God damn it. I got one of them. Counts as a PMC kill. I'll take it. I will take it, because we got a bunch of those kits that we can rerun. I thought I was far enough behind the rock for the other one. Well, I'll take it. So that's another PMC kill. Ooh, standard account. What level? 24? I had a two times scope. Makes sense. Probably would have been able to, yeah, head top of head. Would have been able to hit me in my head pretty easily. What level? 31 to 50. So that guy might have been um, his buddy carrying him. Oof. This is a rough spot. Uh, gonna go up this way, kind of go to the back and head towards the chalet, and then possibly come right back and take Southern Roan right back out. Okay. Just have to be somewhat careful because people will sort of be waiting for you.
two players. Ho! Oh. Got one. I can't believe I got that. That's great. This is risky standing right here. Dead body right there. Not sure where this other guy went. Yeah, that's a dead body right there. Very possible the other guy could just be down in that ditch, kind of waiting for me. Can I lay down right here? There I can. Right there, now I can see the body. And now I'm laying down. This is just risky because I'm so exposed. Yeah, go loot him. Are you actually? Jesus. I think those were PMCs. I could be wrong though, because that one guy just wearing the red kind of throws me off. I really want to go check that, but it's just such an exposed area. What I could do, uh, where is Punisher? it Punisher part four okay so those are scavs so that means that one shooting there might be scav not super sure and this is real risky thank you holy crap all right so that's another scav so our eight scav kills we only need two more. Okay. I kind of want to stay here for a second. What I'll probably do is I'll head back. I'll mark that, um, what is it called, tank thing. And then come back this way and hopefully more scabs will be here. And hopefully I don't get shot and killed here. I didn't even think about marking this before until after I came down here a little bit more. It almost sounded like I heard somebody ADS. Which is why I'm still going over this way. Gonna run back over here, try to get some cover. Not be straight out in the middle, in the open. 
Then we're going to go back and see if two more scavs wandered up. Hopefully they did. Hopefully we can get that part of furniture done right now. Wait here for a couple seconds till this is done, and then we'll head over. Okay. Now hopefully we can go find a couple more scavs. one. Okay. I just need one more scab. Not even going to bother with looting him or probably any of these other ones because those other ones are just so exposed. It's not worth it. The odds of him having something actually decent worth looting on him is fairly low. I'm not going to be super worried about it. We'll check over here just because it's a little bit safer. And then we'll go check on the front side. Maybe if I can walk over this rock. Jesus. There we go. Cool. Oh shit. Another one? Where? Where is he? Shit. Can't even freaking see him. Okay. Another one? From where? Jesus. Alright. Freaking scab. Come on. Don't let my sword black out. There he is. Shit. Come on. How are you shooting me? I can't see you at all. Fuck. God damn it. Jesus. Okay. What the fuck? Any other scouts around here? God damn it. There's so many. I don't care. I got that freaking quest done. A portion of the quest done, so I don't have to use a damn shotgun anymore. That was a main objective, so I don't care that I died. Little scav army over there. Holy shit. Okay. Oh. Player shot me. With a most <laughs> level 51. What? Why are you level 51 and using a Mosin? What the fuck? Okay. Uh, I could probably buy that. Jesus, yeah, 11 scavs. What the? God damn it. Wow. 11 freaking scavs right there. All right, proper. So I got Punisher. Yep, that piece is done. So I just need PMC's scav vest on Lighthouse. Cool. Um, I did give this, right? Yeah. Yeah, because I'm onto that part. Okay. Oh, I just need money spent on him. What am I doing? Um, trading. What will you buy? 39.7?
same spawn as we had a minute ago. Oh, come on. Is that someone there? I don't think so. No, that's a rock. Don't see anybody. This is why I dislike to spawn, because I know that they're spawn literally right there. And I could think that they're not coming this way. They could have just been doing something and waiting a minute before they actually start moving, and then they could come this way. But they could have gone the other way. Or a lot of other things, too. Could be waiting for me. Because they could know that the spawn is right here, too. So my best play here would probably be to run backwards towards the chalet. Don't really want to do that though. So I'm just gonna push forwards. Hope nobody's up here. kind of spooked me. Okay. We'll run across this way. When I get this one over here, this is the route I normally go. I don't think I have northern passes this spawn though. I don't. So it's going to be the unfortunate thing is I'm going to have to backtrack to get out. But I got a, quite a few quests I can complete up here. There's a stash somewhere right here. Maybe there's one up here somewhere. I never remember exactly where it's at. TT. Yeah. All right. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run all the way up here. Kind of avoid the rogues a little bit and hopefully avoid the mines. I can't remember exactly where they are at. I know if I stay on the rock, I'm pretty certain they're literally on that path, but I'm not for sure on that. Oof. Do I risk it? I can't remember if they're on this path or not. So I'm gonna just kind of go slow and hope that they aren't. Okay, I think it should be good. See the rogue right there? Okay, that's where the car extract would be. Hopefully this isn't considered too close to the rogues that they're gonna get aggro on me. If I do, I'm just dead. All right, so I need to hit the tent back there for therapist. So that guy's looking off the way still. The one I'm most concerned about is the guy on that corner. Because if there is someone there, I'm pretty damn close. Okay. Cool. It didn't get aggro on me. So I'm in the clear for right now. Really? That burnt my arm? What the fuck? 
That's stupid. Did any mark of this or anything? I don't think so. But I do want to double check that really quick. I'll uh, just make sure I don't have to mark it for therapist drug trafficking. <sighs> wi Fi camera. Fantastic. Ooh, Iridium. Thank you very much. I'll definitely be taking that. I swear I just saw another white dot. Not super sure if it was remaining. Oh, sugar. Yeah, it might have just been remaining from when I grabbed the iridium. worth of shooting at. What ammo is that? Oh. Okay. Right, well, somebody's trying to get in here. Scav there. I think that's just a normal scav. I don't want to get too close here. I'm pretty confident those are rogues, and if I aggro the rogues, I am fucked at this point. Nobody sees me. Oh shit. Okay. I need to go inside of these buildings. I also need to get on the roofs. Which I'm not gonna do yet. Check the high value spawn over here. Wait. Um, oh, it's right here. Okay. Euros. Let's stamina regain for just a second. It's PP. It's not bad, but it's only eight rounds. I mean, it's not going to help me too much. I 
kind of thought I heard somebody. Tempted to run over to that building, but I also don't want to because Where are you? that. Oh, that's a guy on the roof, I bet, of this building. through there for a second. I'm real nervous about doing this because I'm pretty sure there's rogues inside this building. But if I can grab it and get out, it'll be nice. this building, right? Pretty sure it is, but it's like on the second story of something. So I'm not sure because this isn't looking like the right spot. But I could have sworn it was. I can't search that. Alright. Oh, it's over there. up there. I think it's that left one. Yeah, it's like right here. Perfect. Okay, now I can get out of here. gonna be my best route. Shit. No idea if that was a rogue or not. Really hope not. in a row. Thank God. Just a normal scab. Oh, that could have been bad. Okay. Alright. Is the car here? That could be a great route out if the car is here. Uh, of course it isn't. Okay. Well, we're going to kind of go the same way we came in. We're going to go that way out. Okay. Shouldn't be too, too bad to get out. Could have sworn I just heard somebody over there, though.
right. Back up by the pond. Cool. Now it should be fairly straight simple to get out from here. I didn't shit. I didn't mark the orange tankers up top that I saw. I meant to do that. Completely forgot. Not going back now. I didn't get much for loot this raid, but got a decent amount of uh, quest items. Got two quest items, and then marked the one for revision. So made some decent progress on quests. That'll be uh, three quests done, assuming I get out. Um, so with those three done, that'll help quite a bit. Just kind of help me progress and move. So I'm not super worried about getting much more for kills or loot. This raid just want to survive and get out with those quest items. I'm going to almost build back up. And then odds are nobody's going to be this far over here. So we shouldn't have much of an issue with getting to extract. Shouldn't. I will occasionally run into people though. So there's no guarantee. Never a guarantee in Tarkov anyways. Oh, I'll take that. Sure. I didn't even realize that was there. Slickers bar. Nice. What's that? Relay. Okay. Thirty frames. Jesus. But yeah, frames don't drop at all. That sight. I could have sworn I heard somebody. Right, I'm just gonna run. Okay. Should be good from that person if there was somebody. This is the uh, sketchiest part of this route getting out. If someone's over there running towards extract, turn into a firefight, could just get domed. I should have checked my, um, should have checked my stamina before I started running, but I was luckily had full. Cool, and we're out. Nice. That's a nice little raid to end it on too. Got, what, two quests done? Three scav kills, not bad. Do definitely still like the SR25, even with just a red dot. Three scav kills, three headshots, three bullets used. Only about 12K away from level 29, and I'm turning in two different quests, so um, two and a half quests. So I should be able to get to level 29 with handing those two in, I would assume those out of there. Um, nice. So, nice little raid. Alright, let's hand in the damn quest items before I forget. Oh, that's why. Didn't actually click on them. Cool. M80, a peacekeeper level 4. I need level 37. Um, but that's nice to uh, finally have the unlocked. Um, where is it? You gotta be shitting me. I was literally there. Forgot about it. Cool. All right, well, that's another one done. I guess it's to level 29, one away from, what is it, mechanic level three, right? Yep. Um, that needs 33, 32, 15, I just need the rep. Hand that in, um, 33, 32, 30, 37, 38, 39, 35, and 36, okay. It's a decent little progress. 